Hey everyone, uh, this is Strangulate here. This is my first post of uh, me and my team playing together with my new HD Roxio. Kind of wish I got an Elgato, but Roxio is all I could get my hands on, so this is what we're doing. I hope the quality is alright for you guys. Um, so right here we got a GB Dry Dock. I don't know, execution is kind of weird. I'm really not used to playing this map on execution uh, from a competitive standpoint, but uh, I thought this would be kind of a fun match to, to post. There's a lot of funny things that happen in this match, <laughs> and uh, some pretty cool uh, gameplay as well, just from me and my team. Uh, so I'm not sure what these guys are ranked. This is a game battles 4v4 ladder match, um, but I'm here with a little bit of commentary. I'm not going to say too much, but uh, definitely put my input on some of these plays. So while my team is pushing uh, Bo here, I decided it'd be kind of fun to grab Boltok and back them up. Boltok is an extremely strong weapon, um, support-wise, especially if you get actives. So right here, if I didn't get stunned, that guy probably would have gotten headshotted. Um, but yeah, just trying to support best I can. Can't remember what happens here. I think we might lose this round. Oh yeah, so I downed this guy. And then I shuffled left to try to get the mantle kick on the guy that was still up, the Baird. But unfortunately, I got down in the back. That would have been a pretty awesome play. Right here, I was holding my breath. So close to clutching 1v3 from Yo. Just such dirty gameplay. If he waited a little bit longer, got a little bit more health, he probably would have had it. But as you've seen, that first Baird right there, he almost got up super, super close. So Yogurt kind of had to make a move. It was kind of a rough timing between his health bar coming back and the Baird getting up. So good, good try by him. If he didn't get hit by the Lancer bullet, he, his health would have come back quite a bit more because it just started to regen. But anyway, tough spot for him. So this side right here is actually good side, uh, for those of you who don't know, for Dry Dock. So you you basically can get in there a lot faster, and you can just shove them right down their map, or down their ramp. Right here, I just kind of run at them, <laughs> get a couple kills. The fight at one shot is pretty straightforward. Oh yeah, that get murked by a nade. So unfortunately, the little preview I'm looking at right now, I can't really see the scores, but I think I'm doing all right. It's like a tiny little video that I'm watching it on as I learn how to actually make videos. But at least uh, on Twitter, there's some there's some interest of uh, people wanting to see some gameplay of our team. So although this isn't uh, competitive settings, it's a GB variant. Still wanted to show you guys uh, us four playing together. Oh yeah. That guy's so mad. <laughs> so dumb. That guy had me four pointed and I just decided to try to go for the two piece. And somehow I got it. I don't know how. He was above me height wise on the ramp. I still managed to get it. It's crazy what you can get away in this uh, get away with in this game. They know they cannot win. Why? All right. So again, this is good side. Uh, the reason that it is good side is I feel like you just get there a lot faster. There's not a lot of cover. It's just kind of like a straightaway. Um, when you hop in here, you have right hand. Like you see me hop in there. If I had a lancer, I can just literally shoot them, and they can't even shoot me unless I send one to one shot. Right here, I just do my best to get in there and support my teammates. If your teammates are red and they really need help, you can see my teammates kind of messing up here. But yeah, if you if you think your teammate's gonna go down. Usually the best thing to do is just to abandon your position and just run straight to them. Um, one, they're going to have to clean up the downs in execution, so the best way to do that is to just get right beside your team. Put in defensive shots right there. I don't know how I two-shot down that guy. I have no clue. I know he was a little bit red, but <laughs> that was like Gao 2 t 6 shotgun right there. Pretty silly. Pretty silly. I swear I'm not an online player, I promise. I think this round I get a double bull talk headshot too. Unless it uh, unless we lose this round and it goes to the next bull talk round, but I'm pretty sure it's right here. I have no idea how I got that. Yeah. Pretty strong weapon. One shot can four point you, so it's basically like a sniper shotgun. Like it's like a pocket like 
shotgun. Like, I don't know if it's weird to explain. It's like a pocket sniper with six shots. All right, we're done with that map. So we're going to go on an old town here. Um, I can't exactly remember what strategies we ran on this. I believe we just ran three snipe, one middle, most of the rounds, and then three boom and one middle of the other rounds. Usually what we do on our team is that Nasty, Yogurt, and I, uh, we've been playing together for so long that usually what we do is we run three to whatever side just together, and then whoever our fourth may be, in this case it's Osby, um, he's going to play the one spots by himself just because Yogurt, Nasty, and I just like playing together uh, so much in our spots. Um, if we need to make a rotation like I did there, there was no one that sniped, so I rotated out right away. Um, then I can do that, but right there. <laughs> Luckily, I baited that guy out for a snipe headshot from Nasty, even though that was dumb of me, and I almost got down. But at least I was there to, to cover Digger and make sure they didn't take our spawn. It's really important that uh, to, not, to not crowd your teammates too much in the beginning. Off the initial, like, there's no point in me staying at Sniper and crowding them. I need to spread out and keep map control. So right here, Yogurt made a really good play. Um, he made the call out that he was getting pushed. And so he run, comes back and runs to me, and now this guy's in a really bad situation. So notice, uh, me and my team, what we do a lot is we play in twos. So if we have a 4v3 or a 4v2, even in 4v4s if we want to play, none of us are really trying to make individual plays. If someone is making an individual play, we have someone right beside us with a pistol or a uh, or lancer just to support. The reason for doing that is you can put the enemy in very, very awkward positions with two people. You force them to move. Um, even though it's a cover-based shooter, if you get one on each side of somebody, cover's not going to do much for you. So we always try to work in at least pairs of twos, always. The buddy system, best way to go. That's how we play. So right here, I'm hitting my shots, but, you know, Savage Cantus just takes a little bit to go down here, so everyone kind of handled their ones that round, and that's the reason we won that round. Got lucky. Those are the fastest rounds when your teammates just everybody wins their fight. <laughs> I think we run 3-1 here again. Might be running a 2-2. Yeah, we're running a 2-2 this round, I apologize, so um, I see that my team's losing the fight at Snipe, so usually what that means is they're going to overcommit, so I came to try to help him. Unfortunately, I missed my two-shot down on that guy, so that really screwed me over. Um, and then, yeah, they put me in an awkward situation as well. So I got, I got pinched right away. Osby was able to get two there. Yoke's trying to even the score right now. Unfortunately... Didn't quite get it. And nothing against the team that we're playing here, but um, they definitely aren't a very experienced team. So a lot of the plays we're making are a little reckless. So I'll make sure to upload another video soon against, uh, against a top tier team for sure. But this was a pretty fun match, I thought. <laughs> and I just wanted to get something up for you guys. There'll be lots coming. So, so you see us running our three again, Yogurt Nasty and I. Basically what we're trying to do is we're trying to apply a lot of pressure on Boomshot. Unfortunately, Nasty died really quick, so I have to kind of do things here. I got one kill here, and then I didn't realize there was a guy here. <laughs> so I pulled out my Lancer to pick up Boomshot. Unfortunately, there was no way I could pick that up, so I just tried to wall bounce to get the chainsaw, and luckily I got it. Yogurt was supporting me as well, so I think that really disoriented the other player. So right now we're in a 2v1. Um, what you want to do in a 2v1, of course, is to get on either side of the person. So right now I'm just going to try to wait as long as I can um, if you're going to come around. I think I actually end up fighting this, which was kind of dumb. But again, like I said, <laughs> we're kind of not playing against the best team. We're playing GB and having fun. Um, that was a pretty bad mistake by me, but that's okay. I think Yogurt ends up winning this. I'm not 100% though. Look at him. Yeah, he's goofing around. <laughs> so silly. Wow. So you see, this this 1v1 is just all over the place. This guy doesn't even know where Yogurt is anymore. Hey, you got him. 
So, of course, what you would normally want to do is you'd want to take those booms and hard aim them to the floor and just, you know, kind of finish them off. But uh, Yoko's just being a goof. Put on a show for you guys. Cog side is better as well because you start up top on this side, so with that height advantage you can shoot down on them. You can see here we're kind of just pushing them with shotgun, so it doesn't really matter. But. So I'm not sure exactly what happened there, but I got one shot in. Yeah, the teammate had enough, so he left. Osby's had enough of this, so he pushes him and gets the craziest update in the world. <laughs> we'll win this war. Yeah, so there you have it. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Uh, that concludes that first episode of uh, GB Matches with SYN. So uh, feel free to, to drop uh, you know any comments in the comments below. I love them. I'll respond to any I can, any suggestions, anything you want to see. I will definitely upload for you guys, no problem. Um, so if you guys could like the video, subscribe, and uh, yeah, just, just let me know if you want to see anything extra. I'll definitely get that going for you. And uh, thanks so much, guys. Take care. Peace.